Oh, no, for sure. Um, definitely, you know, me getting picked up by Pittsburgh, I definitely was, uh, you know, a big fan of James Harrison. Um, also, uh, now that he's also part of Pittsburgh, uh, Melvin Ingram. Um, you know, those two guys, you know, with my size, you know, I just try, try to tend to watch people around my size and also Dante Fowler. Is that something like you develop a feel for or a timing? Like, how are you able to like, be able to generate that level? Um, you know, just working, um, knowing how to use, you know, what I have. Um, you know, I'm not the tallest guy. I'm not the longest guy. So, um, you know, me being able to be, you know, I'm twitchy um, using my speed and then, you know, my strength as well. Um, no, when I got to Pittsburgh, they just gave me 92. So, yeah. so since then I did. Man, I tried to change my numbers so many times, but everybody was like, "Nah, I just stick with it." So. When you were getting talked to by the Titans. Did you sort of tell them, "I think I got a little bit more pass rush in me than, than I've been able to show so far"? Uh, no, nah, I just came out here and you know just went to work and just kind of showed them what I could do. And, Um, honestly, you know, like I said, you know, me and my agent sat down and talked about it and, you know, just new beginnings and new opportunities and coming out here, we knew that, you know, um, that they wanted me for special teams, but I could also show them what I could do and, um, you know, as practice and every, each day went on and they just kept noticing and noticing, so. You the happiest guy on this team? I mean, a lot of people be telling me I smile too much, but, you know, I just be geeked up. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know why. Ever since I got Invisalign, I've been showing my smile, you know, so I had to. <laughs> where, where is that, your disposition, where does that kind of come from? I mean, just the way I was raised, man. Um, Mom Dukes did a good job raising me and my brother, so, you know, that's just how I've always been. Well, how, uh, tell us how the right way to pronounce your name, and then how many times have you heard it butchered, and what type of words have you heard? So I'm going to give y'all both. The American version is Olus and Kami, but the Nigerian version with the accent, <laughs> Allah so that's how that's how it's pronounced, and it means it means my wealth is coming. A Dani, yeah, that's not too hard. <laughs> people have butchered it. I think people have butchered that last name. For real? Yeah. A Dani? Dang, I ain't never know that. <laughs> but growing up. Um, so when I came when I came to the states, you know, when I was in Nigeria, I played soccer and track. Um, you know, I was a skinny dude running around. Um, but when I came to the states, you know, I just got to see McDonald's, Domino's, Burger King, and you know, I got fat. So then, you know, the coaches came up to me and tried to get me to come play football. You're not fat anymore. Shoot, to me, I still think I'm fat. But um, you know, out here, they've been trying to you know, get my weight up a little bit more too. So I've just been working on that as well. Nah, once I got fat, man, as, as, as the years kept progressing, once I got too big, man, I, I couldn't do it no more. See you for me, it was good. <sighs> man, if y'all hit me up on the gram, I'll, I'll, post, I'll post a picture of what I was fat, and y'all y'all get to judge it yourself. <laughs> nah, they was like, come play. You know, they just saw a, a big kid that, you know, was just big, so they was like, just come play football. And my mom wasn't a big fan of it, but then. Olamin, yeah. I think first time we talked to you, you talked about uh, maybe the pedal tavern that it seemed downtown. Have you, have you made your way back? To what? I think the pedal tavern, maybe it was a boat going down the road. I remember we talked to you. You were, you were in Nashville. Oh, 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 the, um... What's it called? No, I haven't been back downtown, though, so I haven't seen the little the little sceneries yet. I haven't seen it all yet. Yeah, I mentioned they're, they're trying to get you to back on our way. Is there a specific diet team? Um, no, I just, you know, I've been taking a lot more protein and just working out a lot more. So, um, you know, I feel like that, that in itself will help me. My body can change easily, um, so I just got to kind of watch what I put in it. So it's more like supplements? Nah, not necessarily. I, I'm not a big fan of that. I, you know, I just, I just eat. What, what, what's the key against the Jets on Sunday and trying to flush your quarterback? Um, you know, affect the quarterback. Um, stop the run. Um, rush, disguise, um, and we, we got to get turnovers. We have to get turned on the defense.